And ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of the YouTube world, we are back with NBA 2K21, my career. After a hard, hard loss that we took in the championship game, we are here at the NBA draft. I don't know what team got what picks, and I don't know what team I'm going to be going on. And I personally don't know what team I even want to be on. So, we're going to figure all this out right now. Whew. One breath, whew. two breaths. Whew. Let's go. What team is going to draft me today? I don't know what draft or what team I'm going on. But about to find out right now. Why don't you get drafted? So that's funny to you? You notice how all your questions about the result know the work? It was a simple question. Why do you think I didn't get drafted? I mean, for real. You tell me. I know you had two knee surgeries in college. Nah, that's excuses. You stayed all four years? I wanted to get my degree, try again. You were captain of your team. Conference Player of the Year, all, all nice awards, years. things I've earned, things I'm actually proud of. What's the NBA Scouts agenda? I don't care about all that. I mean, sure, you got leadership, character, defensive motor, all that helps. That's real. Think about those other things. Well, what position do I play? Your point guard. Yeah, I mean, my size, my body frame. Can I play anything else? What about my leading ability? You can dunk. Can I dunk like those good dunkers? Good dunkers you even see at the street games. I mean, it's explosive. Where they love to use. Okay, so you had some of it, but not all of it. I mean, from my perspective, no, but from their perspective, yeah. And then a GM goes on record and says, You're his guy. He says that to his team. His whole career and yours are inextricably linked. Okay, if I become a star, so do they. If I wash out, same. They've all agreed on this checklist, this protocol, right? Duke doesn't check all the boxes, and some other guy does. So they draft the other guy. They draft the other guy. At least they can say he checked all the boxes. Yeah. The fault goes back on the players, not them. Okay, that's why you gotta understand this mentality, son. You gotta make sure you check all the boxes for them. Okay, this draft cycle business, this is a chess match. Okay, if you're not ready for that, you are bound to fail. That's the setup. Whew, now most people on the outside won't see it. But this, my friend, is where the draft begins. Super shot? Mm-hmm. Messaging is everything. Okay, so is there a wrong choice here? Think of it like a spectrum. One end you got Russell Westbrook, loud on and off court. On the other, you got Kawhi, quiet on and off court. You one of them or you in the middle. What you decide will help teams get an idea of what you're really all about. Are you ready, Junior? Yeah. You ready, Junior? Yeah. All right, so we're picking our suit for the draft. All right, so let's start off with the top. Let's see, black with blue tie, blue with yellow tie, navy with... Hmm. I can have one with no tie, right? I guess I'm going to have to have one with a tie. All right. Uh, can I get a... I don't really like the black with the blue tie. <laughs> can I get something with, like, a black with a red tie? No. Oh, I can get one with no, with no tie. Can I see this? Uh, I don't know about that. Some of the red tie, eh, two point. Nah. See navy with the black. Oh, hell no. Um. God, these all suck. <laughs> Let me try one with a bow tie. Let's see. Can I get a black with? I think 
I can't. God, man, why are the why are these colors? Why are these color schemes so bad? All right, um, I need to pick something. Let me see that. Let me see that. Uh, was it blue pants? No. Navy. Oh, it's this one. Uh, I don't want to go. Hold that. Hold that. Hold that. Hold that. Hold that. There's got to be something that matches that. No? No. Okay, okay, I gotta pick the right shoes though. Uh, no. Damn, it sucks. Oh, Jesus. Alright, I'm about to go with the plaid. I don't want to go with the plaid, but damn it, I'm gonna have to. Alright, where's the plaid? Uh, was it the navy plaid? The black tie? I guess the match with the I guess the match with the shirt. I guess I, I guess that's what I'm going with. Beautiful choice. <clears throat> we'll put this together and have it for you right away. Thank you. God, this is ugly. Ugly. Listen, Art. I've had a chance long enough and this look good out already. You do? Yeah. Art and the team were in a top sports agency for a reason. They contacted me, so they contacted you. Not upset. Or would I be? Someone take me. I want you to. Without the specifics. No, just because you sign with them doesn't mean we're a tough deal. We can all work together. I'm going to do plan first. Because of mine. Oh. He beats a rap like, he beats a lot, but I'm cool like that. 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 I couldn't get something like that. You know, a black, black top with the red. I couldn't get something like that. That looks fire. I, I'll take. I would have took that. You couldn't give me an all black agent. So when he's not with the agency, I'll be here to support Harper on the day-to-day. -day. I'm sorry. I completely spaced on you. You're walking in. It's fair. You have a lot going on. It's Layla. 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 Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Have a seat. Yeah. Yeah. Junior. Hello. So excited to have you here. <laughs> I'm Harper Dell. Thank you so much for coming down to hear our pitch. Yeah, I'm excited to be here. Yeah, thank you for taking the time out to meet me. Absolutely. This is the moment. You have worked your entire life to get here, and we are here to support you in that journey to the next step where you start getting paid. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have to tell you, we have the deepest roster of NBA talent in the world and brand partnerships with every company you can name. Our goal is long term. We want to create lifelong relationships that keep you living large now and comfortable in your retirement. In these notes, already rest the shoe contract of your dreams. <laughs> you ever thought about acting? No. Uh, <laughs> I never really considered it, but I'm, you know, I'm into it if it makes sense. Yeah. Multiple commercial offers and scripts for interesting indies that will help groom you for bigger projects once you get your feet wet. Uh, all of that sounds really good to me. Yeah, but right now, I just want to focus on the draft, solidify my position, and you know, find the team where my skills fit best. Well, we have relationships with all the teams. We can gather intel to get you the private team workouts that you but want. Maybe not the exact team I want to play for? Anything is possible. But it is still a draft where teams can and will do what they see fit for their organization. Okay, so that's a no. <laughs> Chaos exists. We try and mitigate that for you, but it does exist. And I'm not going to lie to you just to get you to sign. I want us to start off in a place where we can be honest with each other. You know what? This is feeling way too formal. Way too formal. Yeah. That's better. Much better. <laughs> <laughs> so I grew up in the Salinas Valley. It's about two hours south of San Francisco. 
John Steinbeck was from there. Do you know it? No, not that. <laughs> okay. no. My parents died when I was young, so my grandmother raised us on her ranch. We grew broccoli, lettuce, cauliflower. It was not glamorous, but we worked and survived. And Layla? Oh, I was uh, raised right down the road from here. Oh, Daisy represent. <laughs> <laughs> right. yeah. um, my dad bailed on us when I was three, and my mom did everything in her power to make it work. We know what it's like to want more. We willed ourselves to be where we are, just like you did. There's a vision for you here, Jordan, LeBron, a bigger corporate vision. Companies love them because their messaging connects to the public across all demographics. And that's how we want to position your endorsements going forward. Universal appeal. Okay. Feels like there's a catch coming. No, there's no catch. There's a little reality. Archie, he's a good guy, and we know that he brought you here, which is why we want to provide him with a generous finder's fee as a parachute. But for us, we need you free and clear of all old attachments. Your future depends on an uncluttered vision. All new NBA players have to go through these difficult transitions. So you guys are him. From our perspective, it's just the way it has to be. You should hear what he has to say. Maybe he really is the right fit for you and for your vision. But for us, it's one or the other. You gave me a choice? Okay, they didn't give me the choice. I don't like it. I hope they didn't. I hope they don't. I don't do. Fine. Not afraid of a little competition. But her pitch on the corporate take is a flat idea. You have personality, and you have an opinion. Your boy, Hendrix Carl, Harden, and Bede, they're doing just fine being who they are. That's how we seal your endorsements. Big and bold. But doesn't that idea risk losing endorsements if I'm seeing this controversial? Yes. Yes, it will. But you'll gain others. Others that share your vision and your story. Former football player, Newark. Your dad. The dog. That stuff is powerful. So the administration contract available for me now? No, I don't. But I will. It's called trust, Julia. She says she got a movie deal available for deals? me now. Or ideas with deals they be. I don't know. Seems to me like you should. The agency man, they, they pack a punch nowadays. She may have a little bit more firepower than you right now. But I know who you are. I know where you come from. And I know what you want. As if you were my own story. If you find people to walk away from all of that, so be it. It's either her or me. You choose. All right. Let's see what we got here. Archie. Uh, he's been there from the beginning, so you can build on an already good working relationship, and you can help him establish himself in the NBA. Commission, lower commission. You earn VC per deal, but it will take longer to get endorsements. Great at marketing playground players. You'll earn fans while when playing games in the neighborhood. And chemistry, teammates respect loyalty. Sticking with Archie helps you build teammate chemistry in the NBA. Fewer fans required to unlock the following brands. Adidas, New Balance, Puma, Under Armour Beats, and Gatorade. Meanwhile, we have Harper Dell, who's a big established agency. They know how the system works and how to use it to your advantage. Your commission, higher commission, you'll earn less per deal, but you'll get endorsements more quickly. Hmm. Fans, great at marketing and base stars. You'll earn more fans in the league. And experienced image cultivation. Choosing Harper will lessen the impact of negative teammate chemistry events in the NBA. Relationships, fewer fans required 
to unlock the following brands Nike, Jordan, I think that's Mobile One, Kia, T, that watch, I forgot how they say it, and Converse. Okay, so if I'm with Archie, it goes like this. I will get more from my deals, but they'll take longer to come. I actually will probably get more fans playing, like, playing in the park, which actually is kind of helpful. That means I'll not only get fans from the league, but I also get fans from the park as well. And I actually could build teammate chemistry in the NBA versus from what Harper I'll get my endorsements quickly, but I'll get less for them. I'll earn more fans basically just off playing alone. And I'll less and I'll lessen the impact of negative teammate camp. So if we have like a bad game or anything like that, or if our team just suddenly trades somebody or something like that, the chemistry won't be affected. Honestly, going with Archie is the better deal. Because I'll get more fans playing in the park as well as playing in the league. So that, that that's double the exposure. Plus, I'll build teammate chemistry. So that works out plus i'll get more d i'll get more vc off my deals with my endorsements i mean they may take longer but screw it i'll get more off it i'd rather get more i'd rather the time it takes to get more than the time it takes to get less even though the shoe brands ain't really what i want oh they are not what i want at all <laughs> jesus but if I could somehow work to Jordan and Nike, I'll do it. All right, Archie. Let's do it. Listen, uh, things have not always been so good between us, but I know you. You're the man. I, I, I could dig it. And the fact that you're from here means something. I know I'm making the right choice. Thank you, Junior. Won't let you down. I know you won't, man. <laughs> I hear you, brother. Sir. I know you won't let me down. My foot going to your ass, do. I know you might think you're rock solid, but you can still step out of line. Okay, how so? <laughs> Bad press. Or anything off court that won't sit right with the GM. You know? You can tumble. Blow your personal workout. Yeah, I mean, you know, it's real simple, man. Just be smart. The next step in this process is the same, whether you allow me or not. It's the league personality evaluation test. It puts you in a room with an interviewer who asks you a bunch of probing questions about yourself. Okay, so I'll just be honest. I'll let them know why I won't you know, be aware of what they want to hear. Integrity, character, leadership. Keep that in the back of your mind when you ask the questions and you do just fine. All right, well, should we continue with the draft? Yeah, let's continue with the draft. Let's go. Thought about it. I'm like, damn, should I make a part two? Nah, let's put us all in here. Junior, welcome. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too, girl. What's up? How you doing? This isn't a test. This isn't an interrogation. Okay. Welcome to the NBA. Thank you. Thank you. Thank there are no right or wrong answers. All we want is for you to be as open and honest as possible. Okay, I'm ready. Okay, let's get started. What would one of your family members tell us about you? I just want to be best, let it compete in music going I'm never too high or low. I got a big personality. Uh, I love to compete. That's a good question. I think they tell you that even as a kid, I always wanted to be the best. I love to compete. It didn't matter if it was tic-tac-toe or dodgeball or whatever. I wanted to win. I needed to. 
And that's the first thing they'd say. Oh yeah, I used to take losing. <laughs> I used to take losing really hard. Now I throw a fit about it. My family still takes me about it. Great, but plus stock, let's go. I'm curious. Talk to me. How do you deal with the teammates you don't like? Uh yeah. That doesn't really happen a lot to be honest with you. Does I just try to work out whatever differences I might have with that teammate? I don't like to let things build up. You know? What if you can't work out your differences? I mean, I can try. I don't really like to think there's a situation where I couldn't see eye to eye with the teammate if I tried to understand where they're coming from. Everybody wants to win. Are you the best player in this draft class? Well, I don't know who's really in this draft class. Uh, yes, um, I believe that's the mentality I have to play with. Explain a little more. <laughs> uh, let's see. I'm in the conversation, and I know that. But who's the best can be subjective, like MJ versus LeBron. Let's say I'm the best in the class now. It's irrelevant to me. I mean, I want to be the best five, ten years from now. And that's what drives me. One last question, and then I'll let you go, Junior. Okay. I'm wondering, what's your primary motivation for joining the league? Love it again, baby. Love it again. Hooping. That's all I care about. Can you expand on that a little? Sure. I mean, money's cool. Money's nice. I won't turn it down. But, uh, yeah, all of that, all that extra stuff is just icing on the cake. All right. Gotta wrap it up. But that's it. That's it. Thank you very much for your time, Junior. It's been a pleasure. <laughs> Thanks. It was nice to meet you. Nice talking with you. Best of luck in the draft. Thank you. I wonder if NBA players actually do that. Like, literally, I have to take a personality test. I'm super curious about that. I would love to know if they actually do that. That'd be crazy. That's not a good or a bad thing. Teams check out the data. Someone like you more, someone like you less. The sudden it won't matter. The deal is fluid. I'll take two of those. Yeah, but the results can change where I currently sit in the draft. I do You don't have to. You could stay exactly where you are right now. So I just got to sit here and wait. But not here. There are a few days left before the next steps are taken. I think you might enjoy it better a little bit more. Uh, yeah, I'm glad you think this is so fun. This is a marathon, son. Three. I should burn your stuff out before we even get started. Okay. All right. I'm going to cut it here. Because I don't know what's next, but this is like it's going to be a long process. So, on to the next one. Let's get it.